Yo, what's up everybody? Welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to be doing a reaction video on Passcode. Now, I've never heard of this band. I I was actually doing research on the girl metal boom in Japan, the decade, which is like 2010, 2020, when everybody seemed to have been leaving Destros and starting their own band. <laughs> now, yeah. Um, and, uh, but basically, yes, I was actually doing research on that. And in in some of the research says in 2020, this group, Starry, Starry Sky or Starry Night or whatever that video was, topped the Oricon charts, weekly charts. So that's that's pretty good, right? Um, I went and looked in and I'm, I'm, I just found this first video. It's called Spark Ignition. And we're going we're, to we're, we're gonna check it out. And let's, and let's go. So obviously it's their kawaii metal so they're kind of like falling in that same track as baby metal uh they don't play their instruments um the song itself it's kind of like uh papaya right it kind of has that same vibe as papaya it, it's it doesn't hit as hard as papaya um i don't expect it to hit as hard as papaya because you know you're gonna look at these groups and you gotta kind of um you, you're gonna kind of rate them a little differently um obviously the difference between like three girls and now four girls and yeah we just 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 observing let's keep watching Is that her actually screaming, <laughs> or is that like a backing track? And she's lip syncing to it. That'd be that'd be super impressive if she was the one that was actually like giving giving that guttural scream. <laughs>
I really think it is. It's her singing. But one one other question too is: Is there backing band for all you for all you Passcode fans or people that know in general? Are, is there backing band all female also, or is it just uh, for the video, or either that, or they just look female? <laughs> Wow. Well, that was a that was an excellent video. Um it's a, it's a look, okay. So, is there an age limit to Kawaii? Right? I I I get it like, you know, when when um, you know, when you have like a group and they're like 14, 15, 11, 12 and you go, "Oh, Kawaii." And I know that, you know, Kawaii can be can mean it means cute and it can be anything, right? Anything can technically be cute. But can can a bunch of 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 females that are generally like not beautiful and pretty and attractive and not necessarily cute anymore be still considered kawaii like kawaii metal that's that's just the question because i mean I'm, I'm looking at this i'm watching the video and they're kind of like almost like dream catcher right so uh, at a point do they stop being are they just a group are, are they still fit in the in the kawaii metal genre what how exactly do they fit in in it right that's the that's that's the question i have that's a, that's the, oh that's gonna be the question that we have uh again they look there's nothing quite like baby metal and you can never compare them to baby metal baby metal it seems like they're on an, on another world and it's unfair for you for me it's unfair for anybody to kind of compare them but you can't help it right you can't help it that there's these groups that are now kind of following in that footsteps and i don't see them like like living up to the same type of expectations i know as i said it's unfair every group has its own different color but it's like there's something about there's obviously something about baby metal i think it's the, i don't know if it's the imagery it's it's i don't know if it's because we've watched him for so long um but this is you know again I'm, I'm judging it all from one video which is again also extremely unfair but if so any any passcode fans if you guys have any videos that you guys want to want to share um definitely link, link them down below because i do i do want to see them because i do i do not want to just like compare one group to another group or judge a group simply by one um by one video and i'm probably gonna get killed in the comment section because everybody's gonna give me passcode uh, information but that hey that's how we learn right that's how we learn we i do these reaction videos and again it all started remember it all started with with baby metal went through this rabbit hole and now i know about you know fake gear um mardella's um obviously mary's blood um nemophila and especially love bite so hey sometimes you just have to take the the necessary turn follow the rabbit hole experience things and learn from it and so if you guys got this far in this video thank you so much for liking hit the like button subscribe to the channel you know obviously that's if you want to because i do want to grow this channel and want to be the base of everything that is that brings light to all these excellent female driven bands in japan that we we've grown to love and that's the main point of this channel is to gain, give them that kind of exposure and to share it. So, hey, if you like it, hit the hit the thumbs up, as I said, share it with a friend, um, subscribe to the channel. That's if you want to. And all, also, if you want to support the channel, my buy me a coffee link is down below where you can buy me one, two, three, four, five, well, however many beers you want to give me. And yes, beers. And also, it allows you to join my membership program if you're a YouTube creator because I do um, consult on the side as well. So, um, in, in the meantime, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you guys have, as I said, let's let's have a discussion. If you have any any um, other, other songs from Passcode, comment down below. Suggest them down below. And I'll see you guys next time. Ingat kayo and goodbye.